how to install Xiaomi EU custom ROM based on Android 12 and MIUI 13 on the POCO X3 Pro. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can install Xiaomi EU custom ROM which is based on MIUI 13 and Android 12 on your POCO X3 Pro. Now, what are the prerequisites for this video? Well, you do need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have access to a computer. Unfortunately, at the time of recording this video, you cannot install Xiaomi EU ROM on your POCO X3 Pro which is based on MIUI 13 and Android 12 without having access to a computer now if and when this changes and we have a video with recovery that will be linked in the description and in the pinned comment on this video now how do you unlock the bootloader video for that can be found in the description of this video as well another thing i would like to mention is that make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent do not and i repeat do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent also make sure you have a backup of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device because we are going to perform a format data and you are going to lose all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device and before we get down to the actual process i am going to switch from miui however the process is going to remain the same even if you are switching from a custom rom which is based on aosp you just have to skip the steps which are not applicable to you so here it is i do have the poco x3 and the first thing you need to do is you will go into settings password and security remove your screen lock fingerprint and face unlock once that is done go back go into me account and remove your me account once that is done go back go into accounts and sync and remove your google account now if you're running a custom rom which is based on aosp make sure to remove all the accounts and security measures and once that is done go ahead and reboot your device once now why are we removing all the accounts and security measures we are doing this because we are going from one rom to another and i don't want you to be locked out of your own device next thing we need to do is we need to boot our phone into fast boot mode so first of all go ahead and turn off your device now once you've turned the device off press and hold power and volume down again press and hold power and volume down till you see the fast boot logo so i am holding power and volume down i see the poco logo and bam there it is i do see the fast boot logo and in your case you might see the xiaomi bunny if you are in fast boot mode the next thing we need to do is we are going to go ahead and connect our phone to the computer using a usb cable moving over to the computer now the first thing you need to do is you need to download the xiaomi eu rom for the poco x3 pro whether you're using the stable build or the beta build now for the purpose of this video we're going to use the stable build and as you can see for the poco x3 pro over here it says fast boot so go ahead click on any of these links and then you need to look for the poco x3 pro file here it is and once you've downloaded it place it inside a folder next thing you need to do is we need to extract this so what you need to do is right click on it and since i'm using windows 11 say show more options and then say extract to this specific folder do note i'm using winrar to extract the file you can use any software which you want to once the process has finished successfully you will have a folder with that specific name and as you can see here it is we have this folder and inside this we have the files which we need the next thing we are going to do is we are going to check whether our device is being detected in fast boot mode or not so go inside the bin folder and here and you will see three other folders so darwin is for mac os linux is for linux and windows is for windows let us go inside the windows folder and here and you can see you have your fast boot now go to your address bar click on it everything will be highlighted here and type in cmd and press the enter key this is going to open a command prompt in this specific path those of you who are using linux or mac os you would need to open terminal and navigate to the path for your operating system now here in the command to check whether your device is being detected in fast boot mode or not is fast boot space devices mac and linux users will need to enter dot slash before the command once you've entered the command go ahead and press the enter key and there it is you can see that my device is being detected in fast boot mode now what if your device is not being detected in fast boot mode in that case you have to install the fast boot drivers video for that can be found in the description of this video 
video next thing we can go back two times and now we are inside this folder where you have your bin you have your images and you have a bunch of other files so windows fast boot first install so this is the file which you need to use when you are installing it for the first time similarly this one is for mac os and this one here is for linux then once you have installed xiaomi eu and you want to update it you again have to download the rom unzip it and this time around you will have to use the update file in which case your data will not be lost now we are installing it for the first time which means we are going to use this windows fastboot first install and installation is as easy as double clicking on the file and it is asking us do you agree your internal storage is going to be wiped we are going to type in yes press the enter key and there it is the process has now started now this is going to take some time so you have to be patient also make sure that your laptop is not on battery power and it turns off in the middle of flashing a rom so make sure you connect your laptop to a charger in case you are using a laptop if you are using a pc then you should be good to go now after writing cust it is saying finished but it is not yet finished it is still flashing so you have to be patient and i will let you know once the process has finished successfully you should get a success prompt or something like that or your device will reboot automatically so again it is telling us finished but it is still doing some processing do not disconnect your phone from the computer assuming that the process has finished successfully all right so as you can see after cust it is now sending sparse super one of seven now this again is sending the super partition will take some time so have some patience so after flashing super seven of seven it is again saying finished but again it is still doing something in the background so you have to be patient and do not disconnect your device from the computer assuming that it is finished okay so when it finished the command prompt closed on its own and the device rebooted so that is your hint if it says finished on the command prompt do not disconnect your device wait for it to reboot your device automatically and at this point feel free to disconnect your phone from the computer and there it is we do have the miui boot animation on our poco x3 pro which means we are booting into xiaomi eu miui 13 rom and the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen let me skip the initial setup real quick so here it is we are on the home screen let us go into settings my device bam here it is xiaomi eu in the building this of course is miui 13 and it is based on android 12 and there it is peeps that is how you install xiaomi eu miui 13 based on android 12 on the poco x3 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you